what was once a beautiful country, is now a country torn apart by conflict and destruction. Eleven years on and Syria is still facing the detrimental effects of war. A year-by-year -year photo view of a conflict that has devastated a nation and an entire people. 2011, before conflict erupts. The capital city of Syria, Damascus, was bright and colorful. Before the start of what no one would have ever predicted would be ten years of conflict. 2012, bombing hit Syria. Homes and a school destroyed by bombing in in northern Syria. This normal neighborhood was destroyed by bombs, which killed many. Islamic Relief started distributing bread to the community after this bombing. 2013, millions displaced. A girl who lives in an underground shelter in northern Syria. As bombing increased, shelters, schools and hospitals moved underground for protection. Despite having no electricity or water, many felt safer underground and lived on stale bread. 2014, relying on aid to survive. Every year Islamic Relief carries out Qurbani distributions to poor families around the world. This distribution was for people newly displaced near Aleppo, Syria. Many homes were destroyed. 70 to 80 percent of people in this area fled their homes. 2015, children facing ongoing hunger. Displaced children at a bread distribution in Aleppo, Syria. This was the site of the first bakery we constructed. It was a challenge to bring in equipment from across the border, but it meant hungry children received fresh bread. 2016, the Siege of Aleppo. Destruction during the Siege of Aleppo, Syria. Aleppo was under siege and nobody could enter or leave. Every minute bombs would hit, hospitals and schools were all bombed. 2017, providing critical relief. Islamic Relief has distributed bread to poor and displaced families in rural Idlib, Syria. Serving communities in desperate need of aid. 2018, flooding hits northern Syria. Men search for their possessions that were swept away by flooding in northern Syria. 2019, children's health at risk. A child living in a partially destroyed house in Aleppo. The mother told us how she struggles to get her children enough food and drink, they have no electricity or safe water. They make fire from burning plastic that makes the children cough. 2020, COVID-19 hits. The COVID-19 pandemic has put even more pressure on health facilities and poor families that were already struggling to cope. Islamic Relief has distributed hygiene kits and face masks and continues to supply critical food aid. 2021, a decade of uncertainty. This is the situation in Syria as of 2021. A staggering 11.1 million people are relying on humanitarian aid to survive. 2022, Syria, the largest displacement crisis in the world. More than 6 million Syrians have fled the country and 6.7 million are internally displaced. More than 14 million people continue to be in need of assistance, of which 6.1 million are children. As millions of people face continued insecurity and fear, our work in Syria continues. Donate now and save lives irukco tda Syria